I'm in the bathroom right now because of my kids are having a moment. And um, yeah, so Chinese red wings. Uh, I posted a picture a while ago. A lot of people were asking me about it, asking me like, how did I make them? So I'm going to make them for you guys. Uh, stay tuned. Yeah. flour, white wine vinegar, cornstarch, sesame oil, black pepper, garlic powder, salt, one egg, and liquid red food coloring. Do not use the gel. It's cool, but to me, it doesn't come out the same. I don't know why. I'm not sure why. But yeah, so. one and a half two teaspoons of salt it all depends on your preference so i'm just going to wing it because yeah wing it we like seasoning over here you're going to need about let's say half a teaspoon of black pepper but i'm going to you know because <laughs> once again we like seasoning the garlic powder I'm sorry, y'all. It's supposed to be Chinese. It's going to be Chinese wing, so it's just going to be <laughs> my version of the Chinese wings because <laughs> I like seasoning. So sorry. Okay. But anyway, so the salt, garlic, and black pepper. Um, I also put sugar on them already. It was already some sugar. That was about a half a teaspoon. Really like a, yeah, like about half a teaspoon if I would measure it. Um... So yeah, so I'm gonna put the soy sauce, the vinegar, all that on there. And I'll be so in this little shot down, we have one tablespoon of soy sauce, one tablespoon of the white rice vinegar, then we have well white wine vinegar, and we also have a teaspoon of sesame oil. And I added the egg. Ouch. Okay, I added the egg and then I added like three drops of food coloring. So, we're going to go ahead and take this little concoction. We're going to mix it up. All right? We're going to mix everything together. Okay. So, this is our flour. Now, I'm about to mix this up and then I'll be back again, baby. I know it looks a little messy or whatever, but you got two options after this. You can either put it in the fridge, leave it there overnight or whatever, but when you take it out of the refrigerator, you got to let it get to like room temperature so you don't fuck up your grease. Or you can leave it on the counter for two hours, hour and a half, two hours. It's really up to you. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's up to you. But me, I'm going to leave it on the counter for like hour and a half, two hours. Just to let the, uh, just to let the, it's, it's more like a tempura, so I'm almost making like a tempura batter or whatever. So I'm just going to let that soak and absorb into the skin. Let the, all the soy sauce and all that stuff marinate into the chicken. Then I'm going to fry it. In, uh, I'm going to fry it in vegetable oil, actually, at like 350 degrees for about 10 minutes or so or whatever. But, yeah. So I'll be back and show you guys how I fry my wings. Put it on a wire rack. That way, all the food stays down and they don't get soggy from the paper towel. So this is what I went to like so far. I'm gonna find them again, and y'all gonna see that it's gonna change color again. So yeah, stay tuned. Red wings. So that's the end of the video. My red wings. Make sure you guys like, comment, share, subscribe, tell a friend to tell a friend to come on by. Honey.
Cause yeah, who needs China kitchen? When you got your own kitchen and you can pretend like you from China. Period. Oh, also you guys hit that notification bell so that you can see more videos. I'm gonna start trying to cook more often. Like right now, subscribe to I am cooking channel. egg rolls. Subscribe to mommy's channel.